so what I've got here is um, a variety of runner bean called Stenner, and it's an old English variety. It's an exhibition bean because it was grown not only for its flavour but for its length on the show bench. I'm now at this moment just selecting the longest and driest pods. These will be dried off and I will take them to the Heritage Seed Library. Not everything that I grow is uh, for the library. I grow things uh, to save because I really like, like to eat them. So a good example is this Italian classic, the Bellotti bean, which has the most beautiful speckled bean. And it is absolutely wonderful to cook with. Often it's the most prosaic of vegetables have really interesting stories behind them. And the carrot is a good example. All the carrots we eat came originally from a wild carrot, which was white. And then you ask the question, why are carrots orange? Well, that has a lot to do with the Dutch. And there's an Australian carrot, uh, which is called red elephant. And it's now gone out of commercial cultivation. What was the journey that this carrot took to end up in Australia with the name Red Elephant. And one of the ways you find this out is by um, mapping the genome of the vegetable. 